Let me grab a pillow. Ow, fuck. Fuck. Do you hear that bone? I gotta start working out. Hello, welcome to my channel. So, let me tell you about my life. I know you don't care, but I'm still gonna tell you. So, so my sister lives in Canada and I haven't seen her in, I don't know, three years, I think. Because when she came, I wasn't here, so, you know, a bit complicated, so I, wanted to, so I wanted to go see her. And then I saw that my beautiful passport was expired, and um, so I needed to take pictures of, for it. And I was starting to look at, you know, all my pictures. Um, they're all horrible. I mean, I was 12, 15. Okay, I was 15, but I look like I, um, okay, this is not a security check, can you stop your glitter? I haven't been fed in, in a decade, I mean, I've been fed, I have cheeks, but like, I, I look so... And then I have the one from my visa, and I was a little older, but still, I don't, man, I look dead, I look like I've seen things. When I changed my ID, the lady was like, you look exactly the same, and I was gonna cry because my first ID was, I, was, I think I was like 9, so I changed it and I took a new picture when I was like, I don't know, 19, so I gave it to her and she's like, oh my god, you look exactly the same on the picture, and I was like, girl, I, I'm not trying to look 9, I'm trying to look, I don't know, I'm trying to look okay, I'm trying to look alive, pictures usually I'm just like, whatever, nobody's gonna see them, but I am going to see them. Okay, so I have my primer on and my contacts are moving. So first of all, I'm going to apply a little bit of foundation. So I'm using the Tarte... I'll, I'll wait, I have all the time in the world. Uh, what is it called? The Tarte Double Duty Beauty. But this is a little darker than my current skin because I haven't seen the sun in six months. So, I'm going to use this one that's also dead. Can you see? I haven't used it in a decade. So, this is the NARS um, All Luminous Foundation. And this one is a little uh, wider than I am. So, if I mix them both, um, hopefully we'll get something decent. So, oh yeah, I forgot. I wanted to try this liquid thing so these little drop things right and i don't really use it that much so i'm going to use it i just uh want to try like a few drops and my nose if you hear, hear me sniffling it's because my nose is running all the time so please don't mind that so hopefully this summer everything will go back to normal for all of us I don't know what about you guys, but I'm still, um, I mean, I'm currently studying from home and it's very annoying to not have a social life. Plus, I mean, there's a curfew basically at 6 p.m. Then I'm gonna go ahead and apply, uh, use a little bit of concealer. So just here, I'm just gonna do a tiny little bit because I kind of have dark, um, under eyes so this concealer what is it this is a 24 uh, hour max studio fix i don't know well i told you what it is so here it is i'm going to go ahead and try out this new thing in which basically you use bronzer and uh, concealer and um i forgot what it's called blush <laughs> That's the word I was looking for. So we're going to do... This is actually a lipstick, but I never use it and I don't like it, so... We're gonna use it as blush, you know? Then I'm gonna go ahead and use concealer... Right here... And try to go for the, you know... Lift thing. So here as well. And here. using a lighter shade of concealer and I'm going to blend all this honestly I'm so terrified of ruining this video like I said I haven't done makeup in so long 
and like I feel like if I do all this and at the end my pictures look like shit. So next, I don't even know, um, for the eyes I'm gonna go ahead and use the lash curler first. I hate this thing but it uh, does a good job so. For eyeshadow I'm gonna keep it very simple. I still want my, my pictures to be just like enhanced features but very natural so. So I'm going to start with a clear peachy kind of base on the whole lid you know brown like this and maybe this mix the two of them on the outer corner of my eye and work it inwards so i suck at eyeshadow by the way i keep it very very simple i very rarely go out of my comfort zone which are these simple colors but like i said it's um it's for a, a like an id picture so the point is to still kind of look like yourself i guess i don't know Sometimes they're they're very annoying with these pictures. I I know that my sister went once and I think it was an ear thing like her one of her ears wasn't showing or something like that and they told her to go and retake pictures like on the spot and come back for the appointment. So yeah. So I'm going to show my ears. So we're just going to use a darker color. So the one I'm using is from YSL. It's actually a sample it's called the shock it's a uh, very wet every time it's it's a disaster I, I need to remove a lot of excess product whenever you use it for like five minutes i'm just scraping the whole thing because it's way too much especially at the tip so i use this first and i try to go kind of outwards with my mascara so upwards and outwards and before this one dries i go ahead and grab this guy um, so because I it's a little more dry and I feel like it's a little easier to control so I can go ahead and separate my lashes using this so um, yeah I need to re remove all this part too because I put it back in I'm trying to, I'm gonna try to do a kind of eyeliner using eyeshadow, so just wait for my mascara to dry. A little wing. Actually, I should have done it before doing my lashes, but it's fine. Okay, it's not too bad. It's bad, but it's not too bad. This is horrible, but it will look good on pictures, I believe. I can go ahead and reuse some bronzer, um, concealer and all that. So this is what I'm using right now, MAC bronzer actually so I'm just gonna grab a little I mean a big brush then I'm gonna go ahead with the concealer again which is somewhere this one is green this one is black this one is blue this one is clean okay I think I'm gonna use bronzer on my nose which I don't usually do but just to give it a little bit more definition and I feel like I'm gonna just keep adding steps and then I complain about my brushes being dirty I literally use it for white and now I'm using it for brown just gonna re-blend a little bit here I forgot um, yes, pink colors I keep forgetting what it's called, blush yes, blush so I have the NARS orgasm so I'm just gonna apply a little bit of it just above the, above the bronzer and a little on the cheeks as well because I really want them both to, you know, blend in together. So highlighter, I usually always start with liquid highlighter. So I just usually do three little dots. One on my nose. One under here. One under here. One on the upper lip. And a little bit on the chin. Thanks God I said I was going to use a little. And then I use this flat uh, brush. My nose is running. I hate when my nose starts running when I'm doing highlighter because it's awful. It removes everything. Highlighter, and then I'm gonna use the Kylie. This one is my favorite ever, but it's broken, so I can't open it. I just need to be very careful. This is a disaster. It hurts my feelings. I don't even know how it happened. Over the highlighter. So it will stick to it and just make it way more shiny okay i think we're done i think we're done with this i don't think i need to add any more maybe 
just maybe, hear me out, maybe I should add more highlighter. And then I'm going to go ahead and brush my eyebrows upwards. So I have my little thingy. I love this thing. It's so satisfying. And I'm just going to... So I don't just do my eyebrows upwards. I do them upwards and to the side. Because if I do them just upwards, I look insane. And then to keep them from moving, I use my toothbrush shaped eyebrow brush. It's just an eyebrow brush. Uh, <laughs> And my iconic, um, I don't even know what it is, brow silk. This is the product, so apply some of it on the brush. And you go ahead and set the brow, basically. And I want it to go with something, as I said, very natural. So I'm going to use this MAC lipstick that's kind of, kind of skin uh, colored. I'm just going to dab a little bit of it. I'm going to top that with some Love of My Life NYX Lip um, butter gloss so this one is a little big and then I'm gonna grab just a drop of highlighter it's like the size of my whole finger so that's way too much and I'm going to shit forgot that I had pink to highlight my upper lip and we are done so I am done I'm going to set this with the Mario Desco thing that everyone used to love a few years ago and everybody hates now um, guys I still <laughs> hold on that's a, that's a that's a doctor's appointment. So, okay, so I am done. I'm just going to try to brush my hair because uh, it's, you know, a little crazy and try to, to put a top on without ruining this whole thing. And hopefully my pictures will be nice. If they're not, I'm going to cry. And uh, yeah. So thank you so much for watching and hopefully I will see you later. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. You can even comment to tell me I did a horrible job. You're allowed to do that. It's not gonna hurt my feelings. Um, I already know. Um, yeah, bye. Hold on, hold on. I forgot you're supposed to like show the result thingy. You know, like untie your hair and be like, look at this beautiful makeup that I did. I forgot that. So, um, yep, here it is. Nothing crazy. Let me pose for my thumbnail. God, I am literally on my knees because my camera is a little too high. Whew. Show the ears.